What's up Shady Crew, back at it again with another reaction video, and today man, um, after seeing this young man on the Triple XL Freshman Cypher Man, um, I just couldn't miss this. Now I know that he's just recently dropped um, a new album, but he was on Funk Flex doing a freestyle, and you guys know how I love my freestyles, whether it's Funk Flex or Sway in the Morning, bruh. Either or, I love the freestyle when you're off the top of the dome and you're just going at it. Um, so YBN Cardi was on Funk Flex. Um, so we're gonna check it out, see what the bars were like, um, see what beats they were giving him, and see if he was hitting or not. Definitely in the Double XL cipher, this man was a lyrical monster. Like he's a lyricist, bro, and it holds true. And he's young, so. Um, Definitely got to give him, you know, a fair shake. Definitely wanted to check it out. So we're going to get into this vid. If you're new to the channel, please wait to the end of the video. That's typically when I give my reaction. And without further ado, let's get into this video. Okay. Ooh. Oh, y'all want some shit. Sit my tea, man. Make a little house out this bitch. Sip my tea. Uh, okay, I came in the game with a chip on my shoulder. Looking at the competition, all these niggas is older. Only oh, got two favorite rappers, Jigga and Hova. I'm sipping the soda, Lamborghini equipped with a motor. Till I hopped in the fast lane, reminiscing my past pain, carry it. The cash came heritage from my last name. Uh, I'm from a tribe of brilliance. I buy the building, please hide the children. I'm about to go on the killing spree. No you finna got these rappers. Whoa, wait a minute. He said, please hide the children. I'm about to go on a killing spree man the wordplay this man how we like 10 seconds in bro like the wordplay hide the children about to go on a killing spree putting the artist on notice man let's get it that poem soliloquies, wife I really need these hoes a bunch of Billy Jeans, fake ass niggas, Ooh. snake Billy ass Jean. niggas rapping fast, but what the fuck did you say, ass niggas? Teleported with Michael. Whoa, that's a direct call. <laughs> Yo, that's a direct call out. He said you you fast, fast rapping type niggas, but what are you saying? Like, oh my gosh, bro. Uh, and this has been addressed many times before where you get someone that has the rapid floor I mean flow not floor rapid flow but there's no context there's no content to what they're actually saying so they're like doing it fast but there's no substance to it and this man is literally calling out you know how many people do the rapid flow stuff? I mean M spoke to that as well he was like this choppy flow that everybody's doing that I absolutely hate, but hey, it is what it is, man. Dang, that's a direct call out. I see you, YBN. Let's get it. Recording your light distorted. The best nigga out of the league since Michael Jordan. And what I'm about to accomplish, quite enormous. I don't have the right to forfeit. My nigga, my life is story. Call Spike Lee. Tell him how I made it off a tight beats. I might be the nicest mm. with the handle since Kyrie. Ooh, nice is with the, the handle since Kyrie. Everything that I do, my nigga, look at flex. Shout out to my nigga Joey. Court set at the Brooklyn Nets. Told him I need a ticket. You gotta be specific. My nigga, I bleed terrific and piss excellence. My shit heaven sick. Throwing like a sick veteran. The difference between me and you multiply your self-worth by five trillion your high ceiling still can't equal to you know my worship find your purpose but why my verses you can learn something go soul searching now watch me spin these benjamin franklin's like what does nigga be thinking never forgot to deposit now there's memory banking can't be swanking nigga should really be thinking and your memory mc stop the killing these dangerous you see it wow bars bars yeah what you got Wani? what you got next Okay. He's handling this beat, hey, turn man. Turn this shit up a little bit. Okay, I fuck with this, huh? Oh, just a mick. Hey, different day, different dollar switching pilots, plenty product, plenty proper. Just dropped a hundred K on my new portfolio. You a penny stalker. You can keep your Balenciagas. Got plenty drama, man. I'm feeling like 20 mamas. I'm mm. barely rich, man. I still have a Benny Hanna. I'ma need like 10 Rihanna's post commissary too. All my niggas in solitary. My bitch bad like Holly Berry. We be making movies like Tyler Perry. Shit kinda scary. My God, why you gotta be so bashful? Wow. Something wanna hit my phone with a hassle, huh? I ain't trying to raise no rascals. Cop a new crypt shit. Look like a castle. Hey, getting them coins, uh, feel it they stay guy. 
eating so long, uh, baby come join, uh, I'm getting this money I want, so fortunate, proportionate, lost boy, nigga, no coordinates, remember Christmas, we was giftless, three foot tree, no ornaments, pull my mm. dick out, whole swarming it, Blood cold, nigga, no warming it, mama couldn't afford <laughs> AU, so we couldn't hoop, wow. nigga, no tournaments, now I'm with my nigga Ben Simmons, plus 10 you women, heard him right. it. me and you, it's a big difference, Nah, for real. Now listen, Flex. Hey, you ain't dealing with no amateur. Two tone drip might damage ya. Hit a nigga quick, no camera. I do not think you can handle us. Why the industry so scandalous? Rap niggas dumb, don't plan enough. Let me tell you how I ran it up. Six months, live with my manager. I was down bad on my ass on the cash in the bag. Now I'm finally manning up. Trying to get a sack, but I'm the quarterback of my team. Like my last name, Manning, bro. You know what I mean? If that bitch bad, get in between. Her pussy wetter than Aquamarine. Made that whole scene. Adam Levine. Ah! <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Hold it, bro. Wow. Keep it rolling. We rolling. Uh huh. Yeah, Ooh. yeah, yeah, yeah. If you got bars, if uh -huh. you out there watching this, hold up, hold up, my nigga, wow, bring that back. If He's you got bars like this, the heat uh -huh. in this one, man. submit your material. All right. Yeah. Submit funkflex.com. If you could spit like YBN Corday. Yeah. I'm not sure if you can, but if you can, send it to me. Come on. You got another one? Let's do it. Come on, let's play. Let's you gotta go. come on. He got one. what you let's got. Let's go. Let's do it. Uh, man, I love the diversity. Flex. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's why I came up here. Cause y'all play great beats. For real. <laughs> Hey, I'm still searching on the path that I'm headed beyond. One thing I had to learn was never question a dime. What is life to a king and what is death to a pawn? When I was 12, I got baptized and read the Quran. I'm searching for purpose, answers. Locked up for murder and verses. Standard heard you was nervous, but that's my manners. Grew up in Carolinas, but was raised by the Panthers. Moved to Maryland. Mama used to work at the Sheraton. Uh, one bedroom apartment was so embarrassing. Hard times will humble the soul and low with arrogance. Raised in the trenches with robbers. There's no Samaritans, no charity. You niggas can Confused. It's no clarity, crystal clear diamonds from Africa just imported mm. I realize with money that vanity's less important Feeling like LeBron with plans of catching Jordan Plotting on the billy, ways invest a fortune Let me switch the topic for you niggas that's getting brolic If you kicking knowledge, I'll make a scholar revisit college Dropped out and told professor kiss my ass Now I'm headed to the studio to diss my class Oh, what? Yo, that, that bar was heat Bruh he said, oh my gosh, if we kick in knowledge, he'll have his, his, have the scholar revisit, oh my gosh, Re revisit class, bruh, he told his teacher to kiss his ass, and he's about to head to the studio to diss his class, like he bodied all of them, basically saying, bro, with the knowledge that I have, bro, you can't even, you can't even get this knowledge unless you go back to back to to the to the drawing board and then like i don't even need the school aspect of it but i'm about to head to the studio to diss my class because y'all all fools listening to the... bars that's all i'm gonna say bars let's get it like a second for all of my adolescence am i the dopest out my nigga why is that a question competition is non-existent was born the greatest my parents fornicated but that shit's a normal basis mm. gave birth to a king was in the cloud in the sky to all the other motherfuckers who would doubt is a lie so remember this like it was in the book of genesis i reminisce days where love was real and all the infinite tired of the fake shit back to the basics your favorite rapper's favorite somebody had to say it was caught up in the matrix almost lost joint now y'all motherfuckers go and cost the lost boy Nigga, you see what it is. Why being called wow, the funk flex? Bro. Nothing but bars up here. Yeah, all right, we're, we're gonna stop it right, right here, man. Who is this again? So, let's get into this. Why being Cardi funk flex, bro? Like, yo, this was nothing but bars, bro. Nothing but bars all the way through. He ripped this track. They gave him like three tracks, and he ripped each track, like gave you lyrical flows that will make you actually think about what he's saying, bruh. And he threw some punches out there. He said his favorite rapper was Jay-Z and Hove. So he's saying like, I, my favorite rapper is Jay-Z, the old, the old, the original Jay-Z that we all love that was from the streets. And then Hove, which is, you know, 414, like, <sighs> bruh, like he is, he is a, definitely ahead of his class, bro. Like, on the lyrical tip, he definitely makes you think. And this is why I was saying that 
when I listen to him in the double XL cipher that he sounds a lot like Nas. He, Nas was really good at uh, either telling the story or giving you a lyrical bar that made you think. Like when he put it together, it made you think outside of the box. He even talked about he was born in Carolina but raised by the Panthers. Like, come on, bro. Like, the bars are on point. And that that series of how he discredited college because of his street knowledge, that whole bar was heat. There's not too many, there's not too many uh, artists that are out right now that have a harder bar that they could drop that would touch that line. That bar that he dropped and how he laid it out, there's not too many right now that right now in the game that could match the wittiness of that bar. I'm just saying. I could name some that could could probably do it and more, but there's not there's not a lot of names. I'm just saying. Like give credit where credit is due, man. YV and Cardi is definitely um, up and coming. There's a reason that he was on the double XL uh, freshman cover. He's one of those that actually deserved to be there. And he showed that in the cypher. He's showing that in this freestyle. Like, bruh, the guy, look, Carde has bars and he's lyrical with it. And he doesn't have to do a rapid, fast flow style, but he, he knows how to play around with the beat. He showed us probably about three to four different cadences of um, his flow style within the tracks that they played for him. So he is versatile. And it's crazy because the bars were definitely hidden, man. That Kyrie line, like he's crossing over your fav your fav your your favorite rapper's rapper. Like bruh, he <sighs> take it for what it is, man. Like he definitely is on the up on the up and up. He's definitely one of those up and comers. So you definitely have to uh, pay attention to Wabi and Carde and what he's doing. Um, Cause he's definitely gonna be around for a while, bro. Like he knows what he's doing on these tracks, man. I have to salute the young G because he's definitely doing it. And he's doing it like nobody else is doing it. And this is, you know, we don't get too many mainstream uh, rappers that actually um, are real like most of them rap about fictitious stuff we got a rapper that actually is rapping about real stuff like real day-to-day -day stuff um and is unapologetically and unashamed to speak his truth man so definitely salute to yb and Cardi. the funk flex freestyle was definitely he it was definitely dope for me you guys i have to let me know what you thought about uh, this freestyle what was the your favorite bar my favorite bar I'm gonna have to go with was that that college setup that was dope second to that was him naming his favorite rapper because it was it was one of those things that you had to think about when he said Jay-Z and Hova he's talking about the old and the new like if you didn't catch it you might have had to listen to it again to catch what he actually was saying in that bar but I definitely thought it was heat, man. I definitely enjoyed uh, the freestyle, but you guys have to let me know what you thought about it and what was the hardest bar for you. We'll definitely hash it up in the comments below. But anyways, guys, we're going to keep this moving. Make sure you stay locked to this channel. Your video is coming up next. Make sure you smash that like, subscribe if you're new, and I will catch you guys in the next one. Until then, Shady Crew, stay shady out there.